Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, happy Christmas to every single one of us. Yes, we made it, the birth of Christ. We thank God for just being alive on such an amazing day. We are blessed. We are absolutely blessed. What is the word of today? The word of today is Jesus. He came down on earth. God sent his only begotten son to come down on earth to reconcile mankind back to our creator. So we celebrate him. It is a day when whoever has wronged you, you remember the love of God, how God so loved us that he sacrificed his only one and only son to make a way for you and I, you'll find a place to forgive. If it's somewhere where you've been betrayed, when you've been corned out of a business deal, when you've been mocked, when people have laughed at you, when you're not feeling well, where you've lost a job, when you're in financial difficulties, when you're physically challenged, it is a time to remember the love of God and spend that quiet moment to say, Father, Thank you for such an amazing gift for reconciling me back to you. I may not understand it all, but all I know is that I offer myself a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable, that you can use it, that you can transform my character, that you can transform my conduct and give me your fruits, that as I eat your fruit, the fruit of joy, peace, long-suffering, meekness, kindness, faithfulness, joy, patient, self-control. Let me be more like you because you came and showed me the way. You came and created a way that I could come in through you and all will be well. And all will be well. The difficulties, the circumstances, we live in a broken world. Of course, we were warned. The manual of life reminds us. He say, on earth, there will be trials and tribulation. You will go through pain. You will go through worries. You go through everything. But be not afraid. Because Christ came and overcame it. So that is why we all celebrate him. We celebrate the light came down on earth. Look around you. You see something that is lit up. To remind the significance of this day. It's not just to look for a new outfit. It's not to go around people's houses. It's not to eat the cow, the animals, you've killed the food. There is a place for that. That is just, it's a day when those who you've not spoken to for a while, you can extend that love of God. It's a day those who have wronged you and you're holding grudges. This day comes to make us all go back and reconcile it's a day where you empty yourself and ask the holy spirit to fill you for you and i to do that we need to deep dig deeper than ever before not be carried away with santa claus father christmas and everything no the significant of the day of this day will make you change your mind and as you change your mind you change your thoughts of that circumstance. As you change your thoughts, your actions will change. And as your actions change, the outcome will definitely become different. In Jesus' name. Love you guys. Enjoy yourselves. Just remember, as much as you're drinking, marrying, eating, remember the significance of this day. The significance of this day. Whether you believe in God or not, so long as you're celebrating, you know that he came. Yes, he was born. Yes, he came on earth. Yes, he made a way for us. And that is why believers or non-believers, we celebrate, but let us know the significance of this day. May Lord bless you and keep you. May he make his face to shine upon every single one of us and be glorious to us. In Jesus' mighty name. If he tarries to come, See you tomorrow, 26th, 20th. Today is Christmas Day. I didn't even bother to tell you it was the 25th of the 12th, 2022. 
Love you guys. Stay blessed. Have fun. Mm -hmm.